Clubguys.com presents Paradise, Louisiana. Paradise, Louisiana is brought to you by Circle K, Baton Rouge Coca-Cola Bottling Company, Benny's Car Wash and Oil Change, Demco, CCA Louisiana, and the CCA Louisiana Star Tournament. Relief Windows, Visit Baton Rouge, an authentic Louisiana experience. And by Farm Bureau Insurance. Welcome to this week's edition of Paradise, Louisiana. I'm Gary Rasponi. And let me tell you what, we're talking about a Paradise, Louisiana. We still win a struggle. This uh, coronavirus is come making a comeback. You see here, I'm at BBQ Guys, our presenting sponsor. We're taking every precaution we can. I'm in the back right now. He told me I can take it off. I'm going to take it off later. So you can... <laughs> It's always trouble to understand me, but I want y'all to understand a lot of things that are coming up right now. So we still need to be safe. We still need to do a lot of praying. And uh, don't forget to shop. There's still so much things going on. Our sponsors have really been hanging in. Thank God for them. So I, I got a lot of people to thank this week. In the next couple of weeks, we, we're going to be bringing you a, a scaled down fishing report. Uh, producers and a couple of them are going on vacation. I'm out working hard. I'm doing some interviews with some of the top light internet YouTube fishermen in the state. I'm talking about people that got followings of 300,000, whatever. So in the future, you're going to do it. The next couple of weeks, we're going to be sitting there talking with Chaz. Chaz always contributes to what we do, all the fishing he does in the Pontchartrain Basin. He's been doing it since he was a little boy. Uh, he's been working. Uh, his dad passed away in 15. I got a story about that. It's just amazing what, what Chaz does. And to top it all off, he, he, sent me some, he sent me a gift, or he gave me a gift. You see this watch? This is crazy now. I know it's got to be a record. I know he, he struggles hard. I, I figured that he... Ain't gonna pay no five thousand dollars for a, a watch. It's, it's really touching. It got the it got the logo on there for Matrix Shad. And uh, by the way, you know H and H and Ch Chad and them, they're partners on a lot of them. H and H is our longtime friends and people in Baton Rouge. So this opens a little longer, and we're getting a fishing report. I got. A, a, another talk about matrix shad. So I want to thank these guys. And look, I stopped at Benny's a while ago and they gave me some water. I needed some water. I was out. We got a, we got a, a great show. Uh, I'm going to do it now at the beginning so I don't forget. I've been wanting to do it. I want to thank Ronnie Anderson, the retired president of Farm Bureau Federation. Now, Mr. Ryan was there for years. I, I, I don't even know how to count. He was on the Board of Supervisors at LSU. He had a two and a half month battle with the coronavirus. He was in the hospital. He's home. Thank God. Mr. Ryan, thank you so much for what all of you do for the people of the state of Louisiana. The many years you serve on boards and commissions and charities how much you've helped Paradise, Louisiana. Thank you. And we're going to wish good luck to the new, I mean, the new president from Farm Bureau Federation. His name is Jim Harper. He's out of Rapids Parish. He's a farmer, crawfish farmer, cane farmer, and all them. Uh, just elected. God bless you. Good luck. And we enjoy being a partner. We're going to come back to you with the rest of Paradise, Louisiana. We've got a fishing report and an event calendar. You're watching Paradise, Louisiana. BBQ guys, come see this showroom. It's unbelievable. You can go on the website anywhere in the world, but let me tell you what. You need to visit this showroom. Bring your mask, visit the showroom. We'll be right back.
Why choose Barbecue Guys? Because this is Barbecue Guys. Not only do we have the largest online selection of grills and outdoor furniture, top-notch customer service, affordable financing, and 3D design services to help you tie it all together, but we also know what it is you love most about outdoor living. Time spent with family and friends. Combined with our expert advice, you'll have everything you need to design your dream outdoor life. Stop by our showroom today. I'm Brett Favre. As a quarterback in the NFL, if I didn't stay focused, I ended up on my back or worse. Even the smallest distraction could make a good play or offensive drive come to an end. When you're in a car, the smallest distraction could end much more than a drive. It could end someone's life. Just like I refuse to lose on the field, I refuse to lose someone I love to distract and drive them. And you should too. Focus on the road. Don't drive distracted. A message from Farm Bureau Insurance. Summer is here. Do you have your star ticket? The tags are out, the fish are biting, and the CCA Star Tournament is underway. With over $500,000 in prizes, there's a category for everyone. And plenty of time to still get your ticket. Sign up today at CCASTAR.com. Paradise, Louisiana, and welcome here to Eden Isles. This is one of my punch, my punch lists right now. I've been wanting to get my bucket list, whatever you want to call it. Chess Champon. You can call it Champon. Matrix, <laughs> Matrix says, Chess, everywhere I go since you've been been part of Paradise, Louisiana, and helping us out and, and, and loaning us all, all the videos, you show so much knowledge, but yet you're not even 40 years old yet. And you have so much knowledge in this area. Why? How? You got so much knowledge in 37 years that I'm in 74 yeah. and don't have hardly none. Um, the key to a lot of my knowledge was that I went fishing with some of the greatest anglers that Pontchartrain has to offer. And my father passed away when I was 15, nor was he a very big fisherman anyway. So I never really had anybody showcase it to me as far as a family perspective, but I always love fishing. And when I was around that 15 years old uh, age, any money I could save up, whether it was from work or allowance or a birthday or whatever, Christmas money, I would save up all this money and I would hire the best gods in the estuary and go fishing with them. I've been fishing with Captain Kenny Krieger and Dudley Vanderbor, Mike Gallo. I used to do a lot of fishing with Terry Guggins, and all of those guys have have been fishing out here for many, Monster many South years. Fishman, too. Yeah, uh, three of the guys I named have caught trout in the top ten uh, record books before. So I learned a lot of it from them, from them, and some. I always love fishing, like I said, and they really showed me the correct way to fish this estuary. And as I got older. I just branched off on the knowledge I learned from them and started learning a lot of things on my own. And the estuary has changed so much since back in those days when I fished with them. You just got to keep up with the changes too. You got two or three posts every week if you're putting on that. You fish every day? Or you just, I fish, this, this looks that I way. usually like to look at the weather. I, I kind of call myself a fair weather fisherman. I, I try to avoid the tough days. But I probably, I fish three days a week, I would say, no matter what, and four days a week if it's really good. I have the luxury to avoid the weekends as they are pretty crowded. So Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, I'm targeting, I'm, I'm trying to be on the water as much as I can. I've been in this business now 18 years, and that's 4th of July. Oh, happy 4th of July. Yeah, happy 4th of July. July. Happy birthday, USA, that's <laughs> yeah. what I say. But I've been in this business too, about 18, 19 years, and I've fished with a lot of them same people. And But they always tell me, oh man, not only are you a great fisherman, you're a great guy, they're more important. You're also very knowledgeable about promoting the products and right. promoting them and doing them. And your work ethic is right. unbelievable. You were 15 when your dad passed away. Do you get some of that from your mama? Where do you get this work ethic? Well, when I was when I was in that five to fifteen year old range, my family owned a jewelry store called Champagne Jewelers. 
I don't know how long it's been around. I can tell you it's been long enough to where my dad used to tell me stories about his parents. So I would be third generation on it. His parents were selling product back in World War II. That's how old the jewelry store is. And I would wake up in the mornings, like on a Saturday when I wouldn't have school, and my father would bring me to work, and I had to go to work at 8, 10, 12 years old. And while we were in the uh, uh, trophy business, also we ran that inside of Champagne Jewelers, and I can remember screwing those trophies together all day, like a assembly line. But um, that's where a lot of all of it comes from, the work ethic, and then also the marketing and business side of it. It's not that much different, you know, mom and pop business is mom and pop business, whether it's selling fishing lures or selling uh, diamonds or gold or trophies, like I said, and it's all about marketing and getting the word out that you have a, a good product at a good quality price. And the other key to business is just treating people correctly. And you know, you when do it, you do a good job. We do the best uh -huh. we can. We just want to make everybody happy. Uh -huh. I'm going to make this a two-part deal, mm -hmm. and uh, we're going to come back and talk about this time of year, how you find mm -hmm. fish, how you locate fish, and uh, besides, you, you're a very good family man. Every time I call you sometime, I hear your baby crying mm -hmm. in the back, you're doing this, and you and your wife go together a lot. So when we come back, I'm going to come back, I don't know if we're going to be this week or maybe next week, but we're going to talk to him about how he finds fish, where to look for fish. And uh, when is his favorite time of year? Stay tuned for more Paradise for We Day. The best part about being a member of a Touchstone Energy Cooperative is that it's your Touchstone Energy Cooperative. That's the power of your co-op membership. Demco, your Touchstone Energy Cooperative. For the thirsty, for those who hang out in packs, for heroes, for sidekicks, for those who see the glass half empty, for those who see it half full, for those on the right, for those on the left, for those with nicknames, for those with curves, for people that cycle, for people that recycle, for BFFs, for frenemies, for those with style, for lovers, for families, for big families, for everyone. to the morning, a little large mouth on the new Matrix Fluke. Beautiful blow up right there. Ah, oh, missed him right there at the boat. About a pound and a half or I think you'll be able to see that strike on camera. What I'm doing is I'm using the little three inch matrix fluke, but I'm using it on a weightless three yard hook. That way I can run it on the surface while it's low light hours. We didn't put gas in the boat last night, so I got very little gas, so we're just gonna stay close, but that's okay, because we're gonna show you guys something different to do. And I'm glad we don't have get too much gas today, because it's a, we got up at the crack of dawn, and I woke up to what was supposed to be five to 10, and it's more like 10 to 18 out the west, which is a disaster for our fishery. You can catch them in that, but I'm not a fan. When you come out of Lake Pontchartrain, out of the pass, it's going to be 
super rough, but we're gonna stay in protected waters and catch some residential bass using these little flukes right here. Have, we've had several bites already. Just trying to drive that hook in there. Why choose barbecue guys? Because this is barbecue guys. Not only do we have the largest online selection of grills and outdoor furniture, top notch customer service, affordable financing, and 3D design services to help you tie it all together, but we also know what it is you love most about outdoor living. Time spent with family and friends. Combined with our expert advice, you'll have everything you need to design your dream outdoor life. Stop by our showroom today. Welcome back to BBQ, guys. Here, yeah, you hear that weather, you hear the thunder. Man, I'm telling you what, the rain has been unbelievable. Rain, but let me tell you what, I've been blessed. I haven't got caught in a boat in the rain or lightning yet. You know, back at the camp, we, we you know, I sit there for hours and there's that lightning and to watch it shake the whole, the whole camp. But right now it's, it's uh, probably in the next couple of weeks they're like that. So we got some things coming up. I got a tournament and rodeo report. I'm remind you first of Grand Isle, Big Daddy, Torpin Rodeo. You know, all the cancellations are still going on. That's going to be July. I'm talking about that to be July 23rd. It's on Thursday through Saturday, July 25th. Everything's going to be safe. You're going to have to keep your distance, but uh, they're working it out, and all the people, all the venues over there are looking forward to it. And just hope this virus, this virus starts going down and we can do it. I want to remind you also, your fishing license passed. They passed, they expired on June. Be sure and get your fishing license, both salt and fresh water. You get, you get your fishing license. People that are over 660 or over, uh, you still need to get a, a license. It's $5, but you can get all your license and everything. It, it helps us with federal money when you buy a license. You see on the news right now, the license has gone crazy. Over, they probably up in 50% of people buying fishing and outdoor license right now. This pandemic, all the trouble it's causing, one thing it's doing, people are getting in outdoors, getting away from being locked up. I guess that's, that's the answer. So also now I, I got one fishing report that they send to us every month. Uh, the Lies and Lunkers, they fish the East Pearl River on the 28th of June. First place is Caleb and Christian Baudet, 14.41. That's pretty good stringer. Branton Craft and Jason Lee, they had big bass and they were second, 13.20 big bass, four pounds. Third was Jimmy Doris and Cage Wagner with 8.96. Uh, their spring summer classic, if you've been fishing so many, you can go on it. Website, look it up, it's July 26th. Uh, they also got the 20th annual Lock One Kids Tournament, which will be Sunday, July the 12th. For more information, call Chad Hartzog, 985-502-3227. That's it for our tournament and rodeo report. Don't remind you, we, we, we're doing two shows in one, so I won't have a fish report Next week's show, we won't have an accurate fishing report. We'll have a general fishing report and show some videos and pictures that we're getting in. <laughs> So we're about a third of the way through the Star Tournament. Uh, we've completed the first month and it has been an incredible month of fishing. We've had seven tag redfish caught so far, but only two winners. So James Loop of Gretna is gonna take home the Chevy Silverado. Lloyd Pickering of Baton Rouge is gonna take home the Bent's travel trailer. And now we're on to the Nautic Star. So all, the next three tag redfish uh, anglers that bring them in, uh, we'll get 195 XTS Nautic Star and Mercury Outboard boat packages. So there are still a ton of reasons to fish. There's also six, uh, five gator tails available. And we haven't even talked about all the heaviest fish divisions. The board is pretty full, 
Um, but nothing seems locked up. And don't forget, get your, your kids and grandkids entered, send those pictures to me and Shelby, um, because this is, that is the easiest way to win. Uh, but take a look at the leaderboard at ccastar.com and you can find out where your best chances are. I'm Brett Favre. As a quarterback in the NFL, if I didn't stay focused, I ended up on my back or worse. Even the smallest distraction could make a good play or offensive drive come to an end. When you're in a car, the smallest distraction could end much more than a drive. It could end someone's life. Just like I refuse to lose on the field, I refuse to lose someone I love to distract a driver. And you should too. Focus on the road. Don't drive distracted. A message from Farm Bureau Insurance. Hey, welcome back to Paradise, Louisiana and the Berkeley Abu Garcia Fishing Report. It's going to be a little tricky. Now, I'm going to tell you what, I got some people sending me some videos and good, good videos, been catching fish. I'm going to talk about them. I don't know what all came through in the next, like you say, this week and next week, a fishing report will probably just be running up there and be something in general. So I'm going to start it out in, in, in salt water, and I'm going to tell you this, I, the pictures I got this week. Angel Ewing, the mother of the little guy, Ben Ewing, that caught that them big snapping turtle. Well, by the way, in, in Grand Isle, I talked to Tommy Vidrine, they didn't send no pictures this week, but he's going out and he's catching, get that weather. He's going out and, and uh, he get a little clear moment and running right out to the rock, using live bait right now. They're using pogies and live shrimp, and free lining, still catching 15, 20 trout, big trout and coming back in. I'm talking about, he calls them hammers. He's been catching those hammers again. Uh, you see this picture I was telling you about, Angel Ewing, she was fishing with her dad and him at the camp in Grand Isle, and uh, they, she caught this big trout right now. They didn't tell me how long, and you can see it's a big trout, beautiful trout. Uh, Island Marina, Miss Andy and David, them, I went out there the other day with Ken. We ran, we ran back to Lake Bourne and fished the rigs again. The whole conditions were different. That's what he wanted to do. We wanted to see how, how much change it was different. The water was a little dirtier than we were out there one week earlier. We looked out there, we seen other boats out there to catch and fish. We still caught some, but still to get a keepers, we might have had a dozen fish we could have kept. If you want to keep gaff top catfish, they're everywhere. Not hardheads, gaff top. Mike Deaver sent me a lot of my friends. When I'm by myself, I keep them. Some people don't want to come. They're messy. They, they, they see that slime. Delicious. Filet, cooked like a catfish, is, is delicious. So they do that. that. That out of Island Marina, all the captains have been catching redfish in them. They've been making a long run. If you want to catch trout, you're making a long run to the Biloxi Marsh and then on the outside. Uh, that rain's starting to sound like, starting to sound like hell on this roof here, this tin roof. Now, a, another people, they catch in the, they've been fishing the twin span, they're catching a the few. That water has been really, really muddy. So if I, I wanted to tell you this, you look, when you go out there, you check that water. If it's real muddy, you know, you fish the place, you gotta jump and run. That's what they're getting from Island Marina. Ken Lambert and them, but they're catching redfish. Unbelievable, they're still catching redfish, big redfish. You see here, I got Bobby McIsaac and his girlfriend, Nikki, Paulina from Island Marina. Uh, they was over there catching some fish. They got Art Lewis with a big old black drum. And Renee Chatelaine's been running out to close rigs. He's still catching snap and everything when the weather permits. So, uh, let me look what I got right now. Another one, I, I've been getting reports. My friend Bobby Black and them, they went to Cocodri and Dulac. That's another place they're catching trout. Trout, right now, if you're looking for trout, Grand Isle. Chad says the next 
in the Pontchartrain area right there, unless you want to make a run or a trailer down to Hopedale and get out further. Uh, Trout going to be slow. Few thought print. They'll be here and there. If you keep having weather like this, you're going to have to stick with bass and, and flounder and, and redfish. So we'll tell you, and you'll see more and more of that on, with Chad fishing for bass and in ponds and in them canals. Going to freshwater right now, I'm still getting reports. Toledo Bend, Toledo Bend's hot. Another, it's a big lake. You got to watch this weather and see what happens, man. I'm telling you. When them storms come up, if you're in Lake Loret, Bell River, whatever. I'm supposed to make a trip later this week with Steve Fontana and Joe Mack. I've been canceled three times, so I'll, I'll let you know. It'll be two or three weeks before you hear what I did, but uh, I want to let you know. But right now, False River, catfish. Uh, the Langwalls carrying them, they, they were fishing False River, catching Sackalet. Sackalet is False River. And also, they're catching brim and bass, catfish, False River. The Langwalls also went to Old River. The water's falling. They're not only catching stripers, when I talk about stripers, I'm talking about river stripers they were come, that came in when the river was up. And, and historically, you can catch bar fish and all the landings and sandbars, they're starting to catch, they're starting to catch in those fish. I'm screaming, I'm glad y'all here in this weather, but it's like that. I don't know how much is drown, drowning me out, but it is loud on this metal roof. Uh, another thing coming from Old River, was uh, I, I ain't getting no reports from Brim yet. The water's probably still high. And uh, all the oxbows up Lake St. John, Lake Bruin are getting reports. So if you're going to send me a report, a report in the next two weeks, it won't add to about three weeks. So that's our fishing report. Let me tell you what, I think that's going to be it for this week. When, when you see me again, we're going to be talking here. Over here, BBQ guys. Stay tuned. We'll see you next week. BBQguys.com presents Paradise, Louisiana. Paradise, Louisiana is brought to you by Circle K, Baton Rouge Coca Cola Bottling Company, Vinny's Car Wash and Oil Change, Louisiana Fish Fry Products, Demco. CCA Louisiana and the CCA Louisiana Star Tournament and by Farm Bureau Insurance.